where did we just go? Trader Joe's. And are you making your tea? Deacon's already making tea from our mint plant. I'm going to be planting an in-home herb garden. We only need so I needed to pick up some herbs. And thank you, Trader Joe's, for having them in January. This... Guys, Do you want to see what we have too, Drakey? This is this little succulent deal that I got for um, I'll, I'll tell you table. how you make it, too. You just need a little bit of warm water and then put the mint leaves in half you only I'm need one, up. and then just put it I'm in your tea, and then it's all good. Oh, yeah. We have to wait for a long time. All right, so anyways, that's the start of our haul. Sorry, it's kind of a crappy start, but uh, stay tuned. We have a ton of stuff, like a lot. <laughs> I got to unload it all, but I needed to put these beauties away first. Look at this guy. Oh, my gosh. We spent a grand total of two twenty eight oh seven. That includes the plants that you just saw, so let's just dive in. There's going to be four more bags after all that you see here. You still can't taste your tea? Okay, I'll help you in a second. I can taste it. So we've got some of the Midnight Moo. I really like this over like the Hershey syrup because it's just, it's sugar. It's not the high fructose corn syrup. Um, you know, yeah, it's not wonderful or fantastic by any means, but it's better. Um, these granola bars, I got these because early, early, early in the morning, I'm trying, I'm not going to go to Trader Joe's this week, or Costco, so I don't want to get the fig bars, but early in the morning, shh, Drake wakes up. And he wants to eat like right away. So I like to give him something, something simple. Some spiced chai tea. We've got soy sauce, red wine vinegar, balsamic vinegar, toasted sesame oil, sesame soy ginger vinaigrette, rice vinegar, like just a lot of, we needed a lot of like little weird things. The 21 seasoning salute. I would highly, highly, highly recommend this. Something I'm trying that's new is this everyday, everyday seasonings. Hey kids in the background some fruitios that was deacon's pick this was our date so i kind of let him get a few more things than i would normally allow him to get kind of thing you'll see this was my pick this is also deacon pick yes sir you you can smell but you can't taste it honey you are congested we've got some marinara sauce these are my favorite 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 oh my gosh these are so good so i got three cans of those just in case we're not back for a little while some tomato sauce tomato paste this is something new that I've never had before, but it just looked good. Um, these apple cinnamon sticks. That was a Deacon buy. A dozen eggs. Um, oh, here. Drake, you show, show me the apples. Drake, pick, Drake carried the apples inside. Oh, yeah. Be careful. Don't drop them, okay? Put them down on the mat over there so they don't... Or not. Um, we got... Oh, my gosh. There goes our apples. We've got um, graham crackers, peanut butter sandwiches, just little snacky things to have around the house. Some more of this just so that I don't have to go back to Trader Joe's and get it for a while. Um, this is delicious yogurt. This whipping cream is so handy. So I got two of those. Four lemons. Some birthday cards for my monthly project. Pears. And look at this. We got a bum pear. Major bummer. Pomelo. This is, um, a Deacon buy that I'm not upset about. But, um, I didn't really even notice. So we've got some lentils. We actually got four of those. Some apples. Another dozen eggs. All right, I ran out of space. I think I showed you guys the strawberries. Anyways, Deacon got his juice squeezes. He loves these things, and he hasn't had them in so long. And then I got this sparkling mineral water, just like a little treat. We got two things of ground turkey. I'm going to come back to this. Some fresh basil. I got fresh basil. And then, oh, I forgot. Darn it. I was going to add cheese to that. Well, shucks. Um, Deacon got these pecan pralines, or pecan, depending on where you're from. Uh... You know, they're interesting. I'm excited to try them. I was thinking that if I made cookies or something after the diet, but then I will uh, do it. Some butter lettuce. What I'm thinking I'm going to do with that is do a, um, and that's why I got mushrooms, do like, you know, like a chicken lettuce wrap salad. I don't know. I just saw this butter lettuce and that's what came to mind. I'm like, that's what I need. Some kale for juicing, the mushrooms for that, tomatoes, another one of the yogurts, some sliced turkey, some gnocchi. Four avos. We've got some bananas. I love the little ones, even though they're the same price there either way. This um, ruby red chai. Some of their, you know, their Ritz crackers. Some herb salad mix. Some power to the greens. This is for salads. This is for juicing. Deacon picked out this freeze dried mango. Some taco shells. That's another Deacon. We've got some um, Persian cucumbers, broccoli, peppers. I'm gonna do some sloppy joes. These cookies. These are. Um, delectable soft gingerbread cookies that are chocolate covered. Deacon liked them. I thought they were absolutely terrible. They have something in them that I don't like. I wanted to see. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't even know what it's going to be, but I don't like in there. They're like full of, huh, I don't know. Um, I don't like them. 
I wouldn't recommend them. Some more granola bars. I don't have to buy them forever. And then some flour tortillas. And that was Deacon. He really wanted some burritos. And I got, you know, massive amount of beans. So it's all good. Okay, so this is something that I got. And this was kind of like a splurgy type item. And I looked at so many different cookies there. And I was like drooling over all of them. And this one, for some reason, just got me. I think it was the mystery of not knowing what they looked like. So I figured I would share this with you guys. I've opened it, but I've not looked inside. I just kind of like took the label off since I'm doing this one-handed. So um, I don't know what to expect. But anyways, we've got, there's an assortment of chocolate chips, snickerdoodle, almond bar, and vanilla pretzel butter cookies. Like, hello. It sounds amazing. Oh, for some reason I was expecting like a bucket of cookies. Oh, maybe there is. Oh, oh. That's not what I was expecting at all. So this must be the vanilla pretzel, snickerdoodle almond. Ooh, that would be so good with a cup of coffee. It's like a, mm, a bit biscotti-esque. And then chocolate chip. Wow, that's fun. It looks like it's maybe three or four layers deep. Let's see if I can tell you. Yeah, it looks like it's three layers deep. Oh, that's kind of cool. Anyways, um, yeah, so that's my Trader Joe's haul. It ate almost half of my budget for the month, but um, we are stocked. Actually, I haven't really been shopping this month either, so anyways, uh, that's it. Bye, guys.